I'm going to be measuring medial and lateral rotation of the shoulder joint with the goniometer. So the first thing we're going to do is make sure that the client gets into the starting position, which I call neutral. So I need 90 degrees at the shoulder, 90 degrees at the elbow. If I just let the client drop into that medial rotation, you'll find that they probably come out of all the angles and therefore their shoulder looks more flexible than it actually is. So from here, I just use the olecranon process as a bit of a guide and let them drop forward from that position. Once we get to that end range, the client should uh, stay where it is. Now you've got two hands to use your goniometer. So the central point here, I'm gonna place on the olecranon process. One arm goes up to the ceiling, more vertical, and the other arm of the goniometer goes to that ulnar styloid process. So for medial rotation here, we've just gone through 52 degrees. And lateral rotation is the same. Starting position here, let the arm drop backwards until it comes to a natural end. Okay, and then we should be able to release that, get the goniometer, pivot point through the olecranon process, and the other arm goes up to the ulnar styloid again. So for lateral rotation here, we've got 60 degrees.